Ugh. Okay. Um, first time streaming in a while. I haven't um, pulled myself to do a stream lately because I haven't really cared to. I felt kind of unmotivated to stream and. <gasps> Excuse me. Just very whatever about streaming, like, oh, you know, I if I just want a game, I don't... Oh, man, sorry, my voice sounds messed up. Like, I don't care about streaming, I just want a game, but, I mean, I, I do want to stream. I want to grow my audience and entertain... Not that I have an audience to begin with, but I want to entertain people. And this is a way I can do it easily. So, um... New Vegas. I've wanted to stream this game since forever. Uh, this was one of the very first things I even attempted to stream because uh, I love New Vegas. It's one of my favorite games. And I do have the Ultimate Edition, so we are going to get all these annoying ass... Oh, I skipped the New Vegas bounties pop-up. I should have read that out, but that's okay. Excuse me. Okay, I do have a shit ton of mods. Like, I have a lot of mods. Uh, mostly, like, bug fixes, new weapons, and stuff. Uh, I do have, like, some things. Uh, I do have, like, New Vegas bounties. Um, if there's any mods that you want to see, like, on the stream, or think that I should use just because, oh, they're good mods, I like them, you should use them. Uh, just let me know, because I would obviously like to have a fun stream car. Have a nice and fun gaming experience. Because I like gaming. I like, uh, I like New Vegas. This is one of my favorite games that I've ever played. I'm going to check my Twitch to see... Okay, I am overshadowing the game by a bit, so I'm going to turn that up and we'll see how that is. Okay. Uh, continue. How'd I do? Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so the game isn't overshadowing my voice now. Also, you can't pick up my phone, so that's good. <gasps> Excuse me. Uh, oh, are there... I typically play as a lady because, you know, but... Uh, I don't know if, like, the female sex-oriented perks are better, or the male sex-oriented perks are better, because there is confirmed Bachelor. Ah, uh, I'll just play as a dude. Also, I need to work... Oh my god, that was a gas bubble in my throat. I need to work on my voice trainings. Maybe that's something I can do. Well, I got most of it right I'll play anyway. as a dude Stuff because like I know there's a couple of things I can do for some guaranteed, like, interactions. Although, oh, I'll be missing out on the one with Christine. But I can get a discount from Old Lady Gibson. I can get a discount and better repairs from Knight Major? Major Knight? from uh, the 188, not 188, the NCR place. Oh man. Yeah, I'll just I don't know. Why am I, <laughs> this is what I'm getting hung up on, really? I don't know why I'm making such a big thing out of this. Male gets slightly more content, female clothing looks cooler, and Mr. New Vegas's dialogue will make slightly more. Okay. Hmm.
sex specific time. God, ah, uh, I don't know the specific like sex specific interactions though. So like, I don't know if they're, uh, man. So, I want to be male so I can use Confirmed Bachelor on Night Race, or Major Night, because that would be good at the start of the game. Eh, I don't even know how far this is going to go. Well, whatever. We be gaming. We be gaming. Uh, Hispanic. Old. Should I be, like, super old? That's as old as... Nah. Okay. Um. Oh. 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 We'll just go random a bunch. Oh, is it random between these separate, like, presets? So the others look like. Oh, she had a very small face. I guess I'll just go with the standard. I shouldn't get so hung up on this. Uh, which hairstyle do I like the most? It doesn't really matter. I like the dragon. And I don't like any of the, um... What are they called? Any of the, the like, fiend haircuts. I don't like those. Purple hair. Sure. I bet I have pronouns. Okay. No sense keeping you in bed anymore. You Let's with see the blue if we can get you on your feet. Good. Why don't I made you walk down to the end of the room? room? Over by it's that big tester machine there. Okay. Take it slow now. It ain't a race. Firstly, we're gonna take all this dude's shit. Because, yeah, okay. because we can. I think when you're a streamer, it's polite to say we. That's what I've noticed with streamers. They say we, or most, I guess, content creators. Instead of saying like, oh, I'm gonna do, or they say we. And I guess it's nice. Looking good so far. I should probably do that. I get it creates like, you know, a sense of inclusion we'll with the right streamer and you're not like so. It makes it feel more personal. I don't know why I'm trying to get down to the psychology of this. Oh, 4570? At the start, man. Oh, take all these cigarettes. Business wear for that charisma. I think it gives me the charisma boost thing. Back so cleaner, might as well. Yeast. Back so cleaner. I need this stuff later to make bomb. Bombs? I'll need this stuff to make bombs later, so I might as well take them out. Oh! My leg got very itchy. Excuse me. Uh, charisma, get all that out of there. Perception, nine intelligence, nine luck. How long you can sprint? Oh yes, I do have a sprinting mod enabled because, you know, standard New Vegas is kind of slow moving in my opinion. Um, okay. Have these both at nine. I can't always have lucky shades on, so I will want this one. And I don't have to bring it to 10 since I can just wear the lucky shades. So, hmm. I'm going to take another bite of this uh, chili dog. Mm. I 
Okay, so. Luck. Put it into endurance. Six perception for better criticals. Not better criticals. Finesse. Six perception for finesse. Six endurance for burden to bear. Or uh, something travels where you can fast travel all over encumbered. Nine intelligence for skills and such. Two or nine luck because I'm gonna bust the casinos, obviously. Also because I like crits. This I'm gonna do a typical like gunslinger build because it's basic, but I like gunslingering. I've never tried a melee build before. I know I'm missing out. Okay. Start off with guns, lockpick, and Prepare, science, sneak, speech. Maybe I can take one out of lockpick and put it in harder. Guns. Hmm. Science, repair. Sneak. And sneak, I guess? Might as well. Oh no, maybe survival. Survival is very good. Okay, neglected things will be... Okay, I will do speech. I will go for 100 speech because I do want to be able to uh, convince what's-his-face at the end... Ulysses at the end of Lonesome Road to not fight. So I'll only have to go up to 80 speech because I'll be able to get 20 with um, the the perk that makes skill books better. If I take that and meet, use a meeting people, that'll give me 20 speech. I'll only need 80 to get to 100, unless something is weird with that, but... Okay. Speak at 24, speak at 30, fire at 24. Okay. Repair is gonna have to go up to 100 because I want jury rigging. Okay, neglected stats will be unarmed. Also, I'm gonna tr uh, cheat as little as possible, but there may be the occasional time where I give myself something. But overall, I'm gonna not do that. I do like explosives, damn. Okay, skilled obviously, because skilled is a great trait. You gain five points to every skill, but you suffer 10% experience gain from now on. Not that big of a deal at all. That's a killer, sort of. Oh, that bonus agility, though. Trigger discipline. I don't like being fire rate capped, and I know I could just take rushing water, but, uh, yeah. I'm not going to be taking that, because I like to go fast. Also, Damn, that's just bonus damage. I'll probably take Built to Destroy because I do like Built to Destroy and none of these other ones interest me. Like, I don't like being inaccurate. I don't like being slow. Skilled is just the best one to take. Built to destroy, I love crits, and if I, like, I'll have jury rigging and a ton of weapon repair kits, so it won't be no thing. Skilled. Yep. Yeah. Hardcore mode. No, I will be activating Wild Wasteland. You may have noticed it wasn't a trait because I have a mod. It makes it so I can take it like that. Huh. Must be some frontal, frontal lobe, lobe damage. damage. Says that every time. All right, I guess that about does it. Come with me, I'll see you out. Speed up. Here, oh. these are yours. I must be was a very you had on you when you was. I hope you don't mind, but I gave the note a look. I thought it might help me find the next of kin. Also, I'm gonna not but it was just something about a platinum chip. 
Well, if you're heading back the out there, you ought to have this. They call it a pip boy. I grew up in one of them vaults he made before the war. We all got one. Ain't much use to me now, but you might want such a thing after what you've been through. I know what it's like having something taken from you. And put this on too, so the locals don't pick on you for lack and modesty. It was my wife's. I think she was about your size, and she hardly wore it after we left the vault. Felt it was too brazen. I don't mention it. It's what I'm here for. You should talk to Sunny Smiles before you leave town. She can help you learn to fend for yourself in the desert. She'll likely be at the saloon. I reckon some of the other folks at the saloon might be able to help you out too. And the metal fella, Victor, who pulled you out of your grave. Anyway, you ever get hurt out there, you come right back. I'll fix you up. But try not to get killed anymore. Sweet. Also, I don't think it works Works like that. I don't think you can just, oh, dig him out of the grave and sew up his brain a bit. If I was dead, I was dead. You're That's done. Nice. You are done. Oh, I forgot about that. I have a mod that makes it so that um, whenever I finish quests, it doesn't have a sound like it. You are done. And a cherry bomb! That's good! That's really good! Howdy, partner! Might I say you're looking I like fit Victor. as a fiddle? Victor's cool. Also, he says, how killing time. Thanks for digging me out of that grave. Don't mention it. I'm always ready to lend a helping hand to a stranger in need. How did you happen to find me? I don't know if I should be, like, voicing my character. I don't know how to make it. I was out for a stroll that night. I heard the commotion up the old Engaging at all. Especially because this so is a bunch of like bad so eggs. It's going to be like me doing my usual Once routine. Once they run but... off, I dug you up to see if you were still kicking. Turns out you were. So I hauled you off to oh, the dock right it. quick. Can't say that I'm familiar with the rascals. Some of the fine folks in town might be able to help you out with that. I burped, I'm sorry. Okay. How did you end up in Good Springs, Victor? I moseyed into town, oh, 10, 15 years ago. Before that, I... Mm. I can't quite seem to recall. Oh, uh, I just realized it's coming anyway, over the mic. I start it's a right talking. peaceful town, and I um, reckon it's as fine a place to see like, as any. Uh, like sensory video, like those baby sensory videos, but with the dumbass memes and stuff. But, yeah. I completely for okay. I zoned out. Never seen a robot. I'm a Securitron. Robco Security Model 2060B. If you ever see any of my brothers, tell them Victor says howdy. Happy trails. Maybe I should kill him. Are you throwing lights? Oh, I'll go over this right now. All weapons... All weapons fall under a weapon skill category that determines how effective the weapon is. Guns, energy weapons, explosive, melee weapons, wall, and form. Compare the small icon below and to the left of the weapon's icon. Excuse me, it's so good. Uh, on the Pip Boy skill menu, damage and DPS. These indicate the base damage and damage per second respectively. Weapons with a low damage have difficulty penetrating, penetrating, penetrating armor. If you hit a target's damage threshold, switch to a weapon with a higher damage or use ammo that reduces the target's damage threshold. E.g. armor piercing. Strength and skill. Many weapons have a strength and or skill requirement. If your character does not meet the strength or skill requirement for a weapon, its aim will wobble with a firearm, or it will attack more slowly with a hand-to-hand -hand weapon. Oh, I didn't know that! I thought it'd just reduce your damage, mainly because I don't use melee. Condition. A weapon's condition affects the amount of damage it does. At 75% condition or higher, a weapon does maximum damage and will only need to be maintained. A weapon... wait. 75% or higher, it does max damage. Okay. I thought as soon as it, like, starts taking damage, it starts wearing on 
A weapon with low condition will do less damage and may jam when reloaded. Repair slash mod. These options take you to the repair and mod submenus where you may repair damaged equipment or attach weapon modifications respectively. Jeez, that was the one. What is making me start with throwing knives? You typically don't and I don't have any 9mm. You typically don't start with throwing knives in this game. GRA, the ongoing conflict in the lobby wastelands kicked weapon manufacturers into high gear. All major and minor weapons dealers are building in new weapons, ammunition types, and modifications. Head to your nearest participating vendor to pursue the purchase. I love gun resources. I know it's not really like a, a like a DLC as most people think of it. It's sort of like a, a content drop. But I still like, you know, I play New Vegas because I like shooting people with cool guns. And because the story and role-playing aspect is great. But I like shooting people with cool guns. People are like, oh, GRA isn't too Oh, I didn't know this stays locked until you find Ringo. Or until you get Ghost Town. Uh, I don't want to leave Good Springs too early just so I can, like, finalize the build and really think about it. That this is what I want. Also, another thing, I'm gonna try not to go to... Oops. I'm gonna... Wait. Why'd they have condition on it? Oh, maybe this is part of a bot. Maybe I use that to interact with something. I installed a couple of mods that have like new weapons and stuff, and I don't know if some of them are still so on. That's why. Man of Iron. Oh, Iron Man. I did install a mod that adds more like wild wasteland encounters, because I think those are cool. Uh, I'm going to. Damn, that's a lot of caps at the start. 1337. Least. Speech. Scotch bottle, iron, nickel Tesla, Wilder Wasteland, Heartless Playboy. Um, let's see what that is. This. Near the crafting bench in Good Springs. Oh, this is just a, a rundown of what this is. You discover the corpse of a well-dressed man. A man who had wires and a hole in his chest where you expected to see his heart. He also had a note of paper which had the following written on it. I'm just going to use that. Wiki... Wiki Tony Stark. Is his first name Wiki? I don't watch Iron Man. I'm not a like a comic book individual. Uh, okay, so this is just WMX adding more stuff. Weapons, mods, and scion. Gunner's arsenal. Weapon mods, sorted by weapon. Okay. Can I craft anything? Oh my god, I'm gonna access this screen. Okay, I'm gonna do this really fast. Three basic types of objects in the world can launch a crafting interface. Campfires, workbenches, and reloading methods. Each station allows the creation of a subset of items, though many recipes are visible at any time in the game. Some recipes will only appear when the player completes a side quest or finds a special item. You may also find that certain companions to special locations could open special crafting interfaces for the player. <gasps> recipes have skill and ingredient requirements that must be met to proceed. If any requirement is darkened, the requirement has not been met. Any recipe that has all of its requirements filled will appeal for appear fully lit. After using a recipe, the products of the recipe will immediately be available in your room. Uh, might as well recycle those. Projectile spear. Oh! So there's a spear launching weapon now. Oh! There's a lot of weapons now. And these are from various mods. Oh! I hope this doesn't get too confusing with all the new stuff down in there. So you can just craft mods now. Sweet. Some of these are from, um... I think Project Weaponry is the name of a mod I installed. Some of these are from WMX, so like these nails I know are from WMX. Uh, and some of these might be from Tammer's mod, which just adds a bunch of stuff. Laser sight. Cool. Okay, do you wait rifle? 45 auto, full auto convert. Whoa, that's cool. 44 revolving rifle. 44 revolving. 45, 70 revolving rifle. 50 cal long rifle. These are cool. I just like more stuff. That's cool. Okay. Um. 
gun condition, breaks faster, more damage, less damage. I'm 12. Okay. And I don't think I can do anything here. I can syringe dart knockout. I don't know when it does it. Okay. Oh! Uh oh. Sweet. See, like a new gun. Of new stuff. Because as much as oh, I'm gonna reload a second. As much as there is, like, you know, it can feel kind of empty sometimes. Unfortunately. Hey there. Don't spot me, please. Okay. Oh, I don't want to start stealing stuff yet. I don't want bad karma. I want bad karma more towards the end of the game if I even get to when I become level 50. Because I want, um... Because I want, um... The level 50 perk for... I think it's either bad or evil karma that makes it so that you attack faster. Because fire rate is based. And I will be crafting a lot of rushing water this playthrough. Wait. Make me lose karma again? I don't want to start off with bad karma if I'm not going to get a reward from it, so I'll just tack into that later. <laughs> mm, chili. <laughs> oh! I kind of launched that tumbleweed. I like 22. Just like as a cartridge. I know it's not. God damn it. Okay. Let me get the food out of my teeth and we'll explain this. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry. Apparel. Apparel can consist of many different types of gear, ranging from clothing and armor to sunglasses and hats. DT. Some apparel grants damage threshold to the wearer. Mm. This is the sum of all damage threshold for equipped apparel plus any bonuses from purchase tens. Damage threshold is directly subtracted from incoming damage. The higher damage threshold provides superior protection, though a small percentage of damage can get through even the thickest armor. A high damage threshold is quite. Excuse me, I'm going through it right now. Valuable condition. Apparel's condition affects how much protection it provides. Apparel above 50, oh, 50%. 50 provides maximum protection and only needs to be maintained. Light, medium, heavy, medium and heavy. Apparel will slow characters down when equipped. I did know that. Repair, this option is a submenu with the, yeah, blah, 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 you get that. I didn't know there's 50%. I see this every time and I've been playing New Vegas like all my life, but I can't believe I didn't know that. What a fool I am. Okay, come to turn around to all these. This chicane. Chicanery bomb. Yeah, I'm a regular old tennis. Also, my voice. Also, I'm gonna not do any glitches. Not that I really know them. Oh my God. Happy trails! Happy trails. Um, yeah. Before you say anything, they're already dead. Doesn't matter. I will need a shovel. And, what? Oh, what? Skull pistol. You found a limited edition Mojave landmark snow globe. These rare pre-war artifacts are widely considered to be useless baubles, but rumor has it some collectors were paid dearly. Also, I will be going for a... And there's another unique weapon, okay. Um, I feel like this is too strong to be giving the player at the start. I downloaded mods that are like, oh, more unique weapons, or, you know. But I feel like giving the player a riot shotgun 
and just a better 9mm pistol straight from the get-go. Slightly unbased. It's just gonna make the game too easy. Okay, so I will probably avoid using those. Full pistol, um, sauna, shotgun, that's not too OP, I guess, considering you have the sturdy caravan. Uh, less, more damage, no, less damage, more pellets. So I'll put that there. Um, that's, what else did I get? Fucking ranger combat armor. I get it's like close to broke, but at the same time, that's like too strong. Yeah, Caleb. Uh, that's not the right button. I wonder what this is a reference to. Uh, here we go. Distinctive cigarettes. Okay. Uh. In the Good Spring Cemetery, you discover the corpse of a sinister- of an sinister-looking cowboy. It was laying in a newly dug, yet somehow familiar grave. Judging by the ill fits of it, the armor he was wearing didn't belong to him. Also, he also had a small doll and some pins with you. He also had a note of paper which had the following written on it. Wiki, the PC game, Khaled, Caleb, Blood. Oh, this is just telling you, like, what it is. So don't wiki Tony Stark. It's it's not, his name is wiki Tony Stark. It's saying wiki, like, you know, Wikipedia, look up Tony Stark for to understand the reference. I understand that. Um, yeah, might as well. I can always just cheat to bring up that menu again. Is that my cousin? Is he pretty good? Okay, so, that might look different if you're familiar to the game at all. I have a mod that makes this like a, an actual house that you can use. I will be using it as a, as a house. Also, I don't know if I can or can't use the radio station since a lot of the music on them is copyrighted. And I don't particularly want to risk getting another copyright strike. Because I have a copyright claim on one of my Black Ops 2 VODs on my YouTube channel, which is kind of stupid, considering, you know, I'm not making money off these. Gone hunting. Gone hunting for the day. Heard some of the folks down at Good Springs complaining about coyotes. Seen them tussling with geckos, ruining the hide as they tear them apart. Good money in those gecko hides. Very true, by the way. Um, when you kill geckos, don't just take their meat, take their hides, because you can sell them for good cash and you can use them later. You can make, like, leather belts and tanned hides for good cash. I'm eating right now, so I'll let you guys read the rest. In this, still got some food in my teeth. When I used to play, when I was like little, as soon as possible, I'd skip all of Good Springs and go straight to Vegas, or like straight down to get. Oh, there's a... that's supposed to be a coyote down here. I don't want to kill it. Too bad. I I don't even have to kill the little guy now. I don't like killing the wildlife. I don't like killing coyotes. I like killing big corners though, because money, but I don't like killing the coyotes because they're just chilling and they don't fuck with you unless you get too close. Hydra. So I would always ignore like this area and Good Springs Cave. I didn't even know those places were like a thing until I downloaded that mod because it makes you go to Good Springs Cave, and I took this route and I stumbled upon the Devil's Hole. So I didn't even know these, like, you know, cool. <gasps> Ooh, I saw Star Bottle Cap. I didn't even know these places had stuff. So, 
because, you know, dumb little me just wanted to get to kill him Benny as quick as possible. Uh oh. Something just got a crit. Something is shooting. What is shooting right now? Oh, hey, buddy. Okay, so I have an idea. I have an idea. I just run, and I don't kill any coyotes. Unless I need to, because, I mean, I don't want to die. Not that you should be dying to coyotes. Unless you're maybe on hardcore. I'm in the early game, I guess it's excuse. Uh oh. Yeah, I'm gonna have to kill these coyotes, I think. Which is a shame. Okay. A hunting rifle, straight from the get-go. And a plasma pistol, straight from the get-go. That's pretty strong, I guess. Oh, that's a lot of coyotes. So... Over and over, and I'm gonna walk my ass. Yes, I'm gonna walk my ass back to the uh, one place that I don't feel like there. Uh, um, like dropping a bunch of stuff and putting it on a corpse. So, yeah. Uh, more stuff, laser pistol. Also, I have a mod that makes enemies use special ammo types, and. So it's gonna be this, which is kind of fun. Or... <laughs> Actually... Hey, we're buddies, right? You got no problem with me. I'm a cool... I'm a cool guy. I'm a cool individual. See? Koyo still got no issue with me. What the fuck? I guess it was just a dust particle. I didn't know they had dust particles in game though that would float like in your character's eyes. That would be part of the game. Though. Also, I do have various like animation replacers. Um, I forgot like how kinda iffy New Vegas' gunplay is without them. And a weapon. If you're gonna be murdering, might as well be one having murdering. No officer, you're drunk. Uh I'm gonna drink some more water. Oh, you were who were shooting. You were who were. Fucked up place called Hui Magoos. Oh, is he gonna come say, oh, you got me. Yep, he's trying to talk to me. Let's see how long we can. You need to be careful. It's dangerous out here. Heck, I can smell trouble a mile away. Yeah, without it. See that you do. I saved your life, so I kind of feel responsible for you is all. Well, happy trails, I didn't want to say any of the other two options, because they're kind of rude, and I don't like being rude. Also, my machete's already, like, kind of busted up a little. That 15%, like, faster weapon degradation really hits you. Almost there. Almost there. Isn't diagonal movement supposed to be faster than forward movement? Is there any way I can speed myself up? No. Do I have buff out? Do I have any buff out? No buff out. Drive alcohol? 
Whiskey, plus one strength. Oh, that's only gonna. And I'm a, I'm a dis, a discus. I'm addicted after one whiskey. I guess we're gonna go see Doc Mitchell then. Screw me, I guess. Fuck. Cigarette light. That was great, don't you think? Don't you think that that was great? Okay, I need to lose three pounds. Oh, I forgot about this! More animations. Um... If I can lose just three pounds... I just will drop... Bone saw? I think... No, you can't make doctor's bags with bone saws, I don't think. Later. I don't know how to be hot. I thought this is how you do it. Something like this. And boom. You are done. God damn it. Oh. What? Oh, I forgot. So there's two things stacked on each other in each thing. Well, I'm not storing my stuff here then. Shit. So now I have to make my way to Nipton as fast as possible. This sucks. Can I store stuff in Doc Mitchell's house? Um, let's just do this. Okay, that's not helping. I have an idea. Do I have regular 357 or do I have a special? 357. Oh no! There's supposed to be a glitch that you can do. Oh shit. Okay, fission battery, finance clipboard, hammers. I want to keep those hammers on me. Under surgical tubing, wrenches. I want to keep the wrenches. Okay, earnings clipboard, empty scotch bottle, empty sarsaparilla bottles, empty syringe, flour, and a cup. Okay. Now I can go to Doc Mitchell's as fast as possible, store some stuff up in his crib. Oh, he might take it though. Because he's like, oh, well, better than boohoo. He did that to me once. I, I had um, a bunch of stuff stored at his house, and he took one of my unique items, so I had to kill him. I thought I, I thought I just saw something. I guess I'm seeing things. It's crazy, dude. So the air fix that I'm using on that house isn't working, so I'll have to uninstall that. This better not cause any issues with my game later. What's in here? Whetstone. <gasps> Turn to six. Also. Completely forgot to discover that. Surprise. It'll help me a lot. Okay, please tell me Doc Mitchell will take this. I'm gonna look some. Best place to store stuff in Good Springs. Okay, 
Between the saloon and the general store are four crates. They're safe to store items in as you travel. First, ammo boxes, first aid boxes, and tool boxes are always safe. Doc's house. Doc will eat your food and drink items. Victor's house. And Victor doesn't need to eat or drink, and he won't equip stuff. So yeah, I'll use Victor's house because he's a dumb robot. That was mean. He's a robot. He's not a dumb. I don't think any robots are technically dumb unless they're, you know, they don't have programs to math and stuff. I don't know. Critical thinking skills for a robot. Logsmith's reader. Okay. Doc will eat them. There's ammo box near the radio for gun-based weaponry. Ammo fraction currencies. Any glitched guns. Based weaponry. Okay. I'm just gonna store all the stuff in one box because I don't plan on staying here for too long. I will use this ammunition box since ammunition boxes are reportedly safe to store. Safe to store stuff in. No. Oh. Typically that corpse doesn't have 308 on it, but I guess that's a free hunting rifle at the start of the game. Plasma pistol. I guess it, it's not too OP, but at the same time, like, you know, it's a fucking hunting rifle at the start of the game. Armored Bolt 13 jumpsuit. Lightweight metal armor. Baseline laundry outfit. Crash people business wear. Right, Brotherhood robe. Oh shit, uh, copyright, copyright, don't copyright me. I don't know if that'll get me copyright, but I don't want to risk it. Risk it for brisket. Because, I, you know, Twitch is dumb. I don't, I don't know if that's grounds for a copyright strike. Revenge. that they used for New Vegas. I mostly... Radio New Vegas is my favorite radio. Uh, I was gonna mention something about... Nah. Eh, forget it. Never mind, I'm gonna mention it. Marty Robbins deserves more credit for his songs other than Big Iron. People only talk about Big Iron, and that's a real shame, because he listened to a uh, fucking... I can't think of the name of the songs now. Uh, Blue Water, or Cool Water? Cool Water. Maybe it is Blue Water. I don't remember. Cool Water. One of those songs. That one. Uh, Doggone Cowboy. Ghost Riders in the Sky. Uh... He makes good songs. Listen to songs other than friggin... Uh... God damn, what is wrong with my brain right now? Also, this appears to just be a base 9mm pistol, but unique. Uh, 12 damage. I think that's like 3 more damage than the base. That's a lot of energy cells! For the start of the game, what the hell? Those encounters, I've done that before because I've played with that mod in my own time. They don't usually have that much shit on them. 
Oh, maybe that's what the uh, Iron Man <sighs> encounter had. Maybe he had uh, that plasma gun. Hide belts, weight of one, value of five. How much does just one of these hides have? I don't know what belts do, by the way. Value of seven. Because I haven't seen. Oh, I know they're used for super stiff hacks. I'm pretty sure they're used for stiff hacks. Super stim hacks. Also, all that stuff I dropped, I need to go buy. I might pause the stream in a bit to take a potty break. Because I do have to use the restroom. I don't want to spill that so bad. Oh! Well, I know I'm gonna spill that. You must be the one Doc Mitchell was patching up. The way I heard it, I didn't think you'd be walking out of that office. I've got plenty of supplies for sale. Hey, Even got some awesome. weapon mods and special ammo. Well worth the caps if you ask me. If you're hurting for caps, I've also got boxes of surplus ammo in the miscellaneous section. They're not great, but you get what you pay for. Weapon mods are things like silencers, also, scopes, bigger magazines. Ammo. Special ammo includes things like armor-piercing bullets, which best. don't hurt the target as much, but let you punch through armor easier. There's also hollow point bullets, which have the opposite effect. You can kill unarmored targets easier, but they don't do shit against armor. It'd be cool if using hollow points against heavily armored targets would give them just a little bit of fatigue damage, because, you know, if you get shot by a hollow point and you're wearing a vest, you, you know, it might not kill you for sure, but it's still gonna fucking hurt. <laughs> you might have a broken rib. It's all about quantity over quality. Trouble is, you'll be cleaning and fixing your gun a lot more than usual when you use those kind of bullets. The leader was a New Vegas type. Typical city boy. He had a bunch That's of great of cons with him, probably Vegas, hired guns. The great the cons normally stay Weapon in their own territory way up northwest on account of them being enemies with the NCR. Okay, let's just for a Can do. I'll, I'll go on this tangent in a bit. Focus for um, okay. Oh, I need to go get my whiskey addiction cured. Forgot about that. Okay. Sell these. Sell these. Awesome. That's just free money. I didn't get a lot, but still, you know. Nine millimeters mod pistol. Straight razor, sounds 22. Leather and after what cats. Beer, bubble gum. Dandy boy apples. Dirty water. Salesman weekly. I'll take that. You might be able to hear it in the background. Some music. I'll take that. And press up here. Box of 38 special, BB gun, BB gun, ooh, small energy cell bolt, blade blank, boxing glove, lightweight filling, boxing glove oil, I don't have any boxing gloves, I'll take those cases, because ammo um, recycling is one of my favorite things to do in this game, even if it's a little lame, pressure cooker, silicone rubber block. That's from W Max and Over True. That's just the base game mod. Yeah. Another satisfied customer. Take it easy now. See ya. Take that. And then I shoot him. 5038 special. Perfect. What was I about to do? I'm gonna pause the stream, because I gotta go use the restroom, so I'll be right back. And I'm gonna mute myself.
Fuck, I was gone for way too long. Oh, that's okay. Nobody, nobody's watching anyway. And if you can, if you're watching the vlog, you can just skip ahead to this point. I'll put something in the description. Like, oh, uh, click on this point to. No. Okay. Oh, is it back here? How many different fucking energy cells do I know? Friggin' energy cells do I have? Excuse my language. Well, like, how many? Okay, what can I make here? Nothing! Because I don't have... That one... Yes. I don't have jump grounds, nor do I have, um... Excuse me. Don't have jump grounds, don't have hands. Cheyenne, stay. Which is like the best perk in the fucking game. Don't worry, she won't bite unless I tell her to. But it's really good. Sure can. Take the road south. NCR patrols do a good job of keeping the highway clear, but I'd keep your gun where you can reach it easily. You never know who you'll run into. Off the road, you'll probably start running into hostile wildlife. My advice would be to stick to the highway when you can. Not in good springs, no. But if you're up for a little scavenging, there's always the schoolhouse. Most of what's in there is junk, but there's this old safe that even Easy Pete wasn't able to crack with dynamite. If you want to take a shot at it, take these. If the lock's too much for you to handle, reading through the magazine might give you the edge you need. I... The You'll need those I to pick the this. lock. Be careful, though. Put too much pressure... Always happy to help someone. Yeah, I guess there's a thing or two I could show you. Meet me outside, behind the saloon. When I first played this game, I was like maybe 10 or 12. And he's like, oh, what is a 10-year-old doing playing Fall of Vegas? Shut up, free country. Um... I... Let's see if I can sync this in chat. Oh. Uh, I guess I'm reloading the checkpoint. When I first played this, I heard them say, Oh, Easy Pete tried to crack it with dynamite. Giants. So I thought you'd just be able to throw dynamite that you have on it and it would uh, open up. But that is not the case. And I ended up wasting all my dynamite in the early game. So. Sure. Yeah, that sucks. Got all these things on my mini map. Oh, I should have let you guys see what the NCR is. I figure if you're watching this, you know what New Vegas is, though. It's not entirely necessary. Though I would like this to be like a beginner friendly stream. Howdy. Okay. Oh, right. Now hiring Randall and Associates. Randall and Associates is accepting applications for the following positions. Bounty Hunter. Job Description. Pursue high-risk bounties on behalf, on behalf of various clients, utilizing any and all means to apprehend and or terminate contracted targets. Job Requirements. Should have experience with firearms, explosives, or energy weapons. Must be organized and self-sufficient. Interpersonal ability is helpful, but not essential. Unarmed or melee skills, A+. Moral flexibility from pay slash benefit. Work at your own pace on your own schedule. The initial contract is 125 caps. Proven effectiveness will lead to more lucrative payments. Potential rewards include a custom revolver and duster. To apply, see Stephen Randall in the offices of Randall and Associates. Ooh. What you say on that? Yeah, got in a. Okay, so I already saved, right? Yep. So wait, I think you all know what happens here. Got him. Saw him. Murderer. Aha. Mother, if it wasn't for like the the stagger. It is kind of balanced then for being available so early. Also, I swear to God, I put that in the. Um... Oh, I see what happened. Okay. Uh, school pistol damage 12, DPS of 49. 
exact same stats, except it looks slightly crappier because it has the fucking Punisher skull on it. It's literally just Maria, but with a trashy ass Punisher skull and some glow sights on it. That's cool. I don't have a ton of mods, so the game should be pretty stable. I was worried that that was going to be one of those. Oh! events for the early game. Like, I didn't think they'd all be here in this game. I'm Let's see what this is about. In Good Springs, you have discovered the corpse of an armored man who was apparently trying to attack the only remaining working windmill in this, of the town. He also had a note. Don Quixote. I've never read Don Quixote. Talked about it in our, I think, my Howdy. Uh, science, not science, Spanish class. Jesus, I never said science. We just touch on like, oh yeah, Don Quixote was a thing that a guy made. Down the side. Try crouching down and staying still. It'll help oh. your aim. Now, that's well, that's a start. But I don't reckon you came to me to learn to fight sarsaparilla bottles. Yes, Tell you what, I gotta go chase geckos away from our water supply anyway. Darn critters are attracted to it. Why don't you come along? Mm -hmm. Follow me. It's just down to the southeast a short ways.
You're getting the hang of it. There's two more wells that still need clearing. Murder. You want, you can come along. Shouldn't take more than a couple minutes. Oh, and more Come ammo. Come with me. Awesome. Now I can shoot stuff. Well, I always could shoot stuff, and now I'll have a better time shooting this stuff. Excuse me. Oh, shit. Also, yes, I do not have a grenade. Now that was some good work. Here's a little spending money for the trouble. One more thing I want. Thought I might teach you about living off the land and making useful things for yourself. Interested? Yes, please. All right then. Let me think now. You're done. You are done. Like you've done, I'd be a goner for sure. I came up here to draw water, but here. You got a stabber. Okay. Knock it off. Oh, I'm feeling better now. Weird. Uh, okay. You have established a reputation with the group of people in the wasteland. Whether that reputation is good or bad, you're finally somebody, and people associated with that group will start to react to what you've done. There are many different factions in the wasteland. You can build a distinct. As you perform actions that benefit a group, you will gain fame. If you perform actions that harm a group, a great, you will gain infamy. Your reputation with any given group is a measure of combined total of fame and infamy that you earn. The benefits and drawbacks of any given reputation depend on the group itself. You may receive discounts with merchants, provoke attacks with tired thugs, or simply be treated differently. Though you will initially start out with a neutral reputation, with any given faction, your fame and infamy will eventually push your reputation in different directions. You can see all your current reputations under the general section of your profile. Good reputations. Smiling troublemaker, good and a little bad. Good natured rascal, good some bad. Accepted, good. Liked, definitely good. Idolized, most good. Mixed reputation, soft hearted devil, more bad than good. Dark hero, more good than bad. Mixed, some good, some bad. Unpredictable, good and bad. Wild child, most good, most bad. Soft hearted devil, dark hero. I've never seen dark hero before, I've only seen soft hearted devil. Uh, bad reputation, sneering punk, some bad, little good. Merciful thug, bad, little good. Sneering punk is bad. Shun, bad. Hated, bad, bad. Vilified, bad, bad, bad. Except. Cool, maybe I should keep stabbing her. Oh, and then there's this guy I can talk to over here. Or not, because he's not here for some reason. Oh, and here's this guy for this wanted quest. Hey there, stranger. No need for tension. I'm just passing through. Probably because I'm a prisoner. Or at least I was until recently. This is from, uh, the chain gang. You know that uh, big correctional facility over east of ways? The NCR was lax on security, so a bunch of us convicts are running around now. Free to run. And free to rob, apparently. That's what those powder gangers do, is rob passing folk on the road. That's because I'm not interested in playing Bandit. 
I got a lucky break with that riot, and I'm not wasting that chance. My old cellmates are just going to get themselves killed once they piss off enough folk. NCR or bounty hunters, probably. The name's Whitmire. Not like it matters. Fair assessment. Truth be told, I hung around with a gang at one of those powder ganger forward posts along the highway. I was afraid to be out here in the waste by myself, but I couldn't s I ran with a gang back west. Old friends of mine from a small, nameless town. We'd run around and make a nuisance of ourselves. Thought ourselves real badasses for our grand exploits. So one day, we come across these NCR boys, fresh from a tour out here. We thought we could take them, prove our mettle. Stupid. So stupid. Naturally, we got ourselves shot up. Those of us that survived were incarcerated and shipped off to different prisons. And I ended up out here, in the Mojave. Same place those soldiers were coming back from. The irony's not lost on me. You're offering your help? Uh, a set of leather armor should... Mighty kind of you, stranger. I'll be here then. based perks. Um, I guess I could just cheat and give myself five charisma.
Everything all right? Everything all right? Well, let's just finish this first, all right? Then we get to... Oh, right, right, right. Okay. So... That should mean that... Save... Hey there, stranger. say that there's a damn because that's kind of like cheating I see that as cheating I don't want to miss out on those perks though Traveler. Sign says you go south. Just look for the roller coaster. Oh, and don't go north. A caravan just got sacked up the road. It just gets worse the further north you go. Death claws. Death in general. But it's your ass, I suppose. Just a hunter out here killing things and hoping their hides fetch more than the bullets cost to kill them. That's a dangerous question. Ask the way a bandit might ask, but since we're close to town, I'll trust your good intentions. I could use some stem packs. How about some nice bloat fly steaks in trade? Okay, I'm probably gonna delete that mod because it's just adding like retextures of stuff, seemingly. Like, oh, camo bar rifle. Oh, nickel plated bar not a lot of like unique things but then again i don't know what which mod that's associated to because i have also i should not have been like installed this darker nights mod this is really dark can you guys see fine i'm gonna open up twitch oh i've been streaming the wrong thing this whole time i am a fucking idiot uh... It hurts my 
eyes. so that uh, the game doesn't have that orange filter over it the whole time. But I installed the version that makes the nights darker. Little did I know, it makes them very dark, and it's hurting my eyes a little. You'd think it wouldn't. Because, you know, oh, it's darker, so it's less bright. But the contrast on the mountains from, like, the sun going over, it's just fucking with my eyes a little. So let me find clarity. Also, I have the hiccups now, so that sucks. Give me the standard version, because these fucking suck. Actually, let me look at the files for a second. Clarity, before, after, so that's better. Before, after, before, after. I kind of want the knights to have the blue filter that they have over them still. Just because I like the way it looks. Dark knights. Yeah, it makes the light stand out more, but it's causing my eyes to hurt. Yikes. CLA, Clarity, Dark Knights, Disable. Delete Archive for Dark Knights. Install. Enable. Cool. Should be just a sec now. And Okay, cool. Ball, fuck a wee ball. Should look way better now. Jesus, dump truck. Oh my god. So much. Actually, this is worse. It's not worse, it's better, but like, it doesn't look as dark. I'll probably end up re-downloading it with the version that leaves the knights so like the, the knights have a slightly blue hue to them still. Oh! Another wild, wild wasteland. Sandy the Valley. Is this the movie Valley? This is definitely Valley Girl. I've never watched it, but I know that it's a, um, it's a movie. Nick Cage? Either Nick Cage or Keanu Reeves is the main, like, dude, I don't remember. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And if you're afraid of bugs, get away. Ah! Yeah! Yeah, 
if you don't like bugs, you should not uh, want to use Oh, I don't have the gun hotkey mod. Yes, I do. downstairs to deal with a nightkin, that's when my game would crash, but then on, when I was playing on that save file, I had a ton of mods, and the game would just crash regularly, so it should be fine now. And then I'll 
also all my shit to the cat because he's a stupid son of a bitch and I hate him. Uh, none of these increase harder. I don't think. Oh, Crystal. Uh, do I have any more alcohol? Looking to buy some supplies? Looks like something from Thing Thing. I like Thing Thing. That was a fun game. Flash gun. Uh, okay. Fever. Night. Night. Soviet pistol. Switchblade. Uh, Desperado Cowboy. Uh, Give me a shout if you need anything. Oh, I should have. You looking to buy some supplies? Thanks. Hello there. Oh. It's good to see oh, a friendly hello. face. I almost took you for a raider, I did. Name's Malcolm. Malcolm Holmes. Don't suppose you'd care to trade. I'm missing a few essentials and... Ah, oh, screw this. Lying just ain't in my nature. I'll tell it to you straight. I've been following you for a good bit now. It started off innocently enough. 
I was traveling, as I often do, and happened to observe you picking Outside up one of those blue star caps. You didn't show any reaction to it, so I figured you didn't know what you'd gotten your hands on. water valve in the town during good, near Good Springs Source. So they are pretty rare. There's an old wasteland legend that says somewhere out there is a fabulous treasure from before the war. Those caps with the blue star on them, the tale goes, are the key to that treasure. They're called Sunset Sarsaparilla Stars. All over the place. The easiest place to find them is unopened bottles of Sunset Sarsaparilla. You'd think they'd all have been picked clean by now, but somehow new bottles keep appearing in the machines. Some say it's old Festus that does it hoping someone will finally collect enough caps to earn the treasure. Other than bottles, you'll just have to scavenge. You can find caps in the unlikeliest of places, and blue star caps are no exception. Okay. Nah, I gave it up years ago. Too dangerous. And even if I did still collect them, I'd tell you the same. There's people out there so mad with the idea of treasure that they'll attack strangers just on No one knows. Money, weapons, water. It is, or maybe was, something of value, and that's enough to get people motivated. It's said that the treasure is guarded by a man named Festus, and he's the one who asked for the blue star caps. It's also said he's been around since the war standing a lonely vigil, waiting for someone to come and take the treasure off his hands. That'll make him pretty damn old, but I've met a few people in my travels who claim... No problem. If you do end up trying to collect more stars, watch out for a man named Alan Marks. He's killed several people for their stars already. Alan Marks. Carl Marks. The guy. I think he's dead. Oh, he's definitely fucking dead. What am I talking about? Jesus. <laughs> that was embarrassing. I think Carl was dead. Uh, what? Bottle Sunset says, bro, is that a new ammo type? Is it like a can cannon? There we go, that's better. Uh, okay, so it should be around here somewhere. Also, let me close Firefox, because that's slowing my game down a bit. Uh, okay, so it's not there, rather over here by the second one. Grab geckos. Oh no! Did what's her face pick it up? Oh, Sunny Smiles took the shovel. What a Damn it! Damn it! Now I'm gonna have to buy one. From chat of all people, gross. Unless it's down here, maybe, but it should. Oh, what? 
snakes venom. Oh, it's the dark pistol. That's not stupidly broken or overpowered. Did somebody have to start it again? This mod sucks. This mod seemingly just sucks. Oh, it adds a bunch of unique weapons that are way too overpowered for the stage of the game. Which you get Let me see what you got. All right, now we're gonna go on. Whatever. I've I've never tried to make a mod, so I'm not going to. Hey, that's not bad, see? All it takes to make a recipe is the right ingredients and the right know-how. Sometimes it won't be a campfire you need. Might need to do some work on your guns and ammo, maybe. Important thing to get is it's all the same idea. You just need to find the right place to set up shop. Workbench or reloading bench, whatever. Well, I hope that's enough to get you started. I'm heading back now. Hope I didn't miss anything good. Hey, do me a favor. She'd be cross with- Now I could do this town. No, it's not the dark pistol. Oh, no. Snakes are gonna break leg left by here. Huh. Oh, she is taking the damage over time. Yeah! You looking to buy some supplies? Can do. Pleasure doing business with you. Coil or speed coil situation? Okay. So I have my shovel. Who are you? I'm done being nice. I'm out of here! Okay, 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 okay. 
going. Buddy. You're done. You are done. I hope you didn't just bring a heap of trouble down. His friends might come looking for him, and I. You're done. Well, you are what's done. done is done. I don't want to actually do that, so... And my game crashed. New fucking Vegas, ladies and gents. Okay, that's the end of the stream, I guess. Oh wait, never mind. Ooh. Okay, it crashed, but it closed itself. It, I didn't have to reset my laptop, thank god. Uh, I'll do go uh, run Good Springs run, and then after that, I'm gonna end the stream. Smoking on that Good Springs cemetery career path. Hey there. I'm done. What do you want? What do you want? He's some trader who decided he'd rather shoot than pay the toll for being in our territory. He's hiding somewhere in town. Would serve these idiots right if me and my guys shot the place. Let me get out of town before. It is now. Me and the rest of the guys busted out of the NCR prison east of here and took over. Now we're calling the shots. None of your damn business. You ought to know better than to ask a man that kind of question. Robbed some people, burned some things, killed a few guys. Same old shit that's been going on for years. The NCR and Legion are still fighting over Hoover... Never been there since the NCRs got troops. Well, you've been causing quite a stir. Glad I finally you got to meet done. you. Got. Looks like our little town got itself dragged into the middle of something we don't want anything to do with. About a week ago, this traitor, Ringo, comes into town. Survivor of an attack, he says. Bad men after him. Needs a place to hide. We figured he was just in shock, so we gave him a place to lie low. We didn't actually expect anyone to come after him. Cobb hasn't exactly been looking for Ringo too hard. I think he's afraid that Ringo will ambush him, which is probably true. He's holed up at the abandoned gas station up the hill. Some of the others, like Sonny, will probably stand up for Ringo if he asks for help, which he hasn't. Personally, I hope he sneaks out of town one night and takes the powder gangers with him. Chang gangs, really. The NCR brought them in from California to work on the rail lines. Problem is, it turns out that giving convicts a bunch of dynamite and blasting powder isn't the best idea. Was a big escape not too long ago. Some of them stuck together so they could make trouble. That's what we're dealing with now. Never mind, I want to talk about something else. Alright. Um, who's that man? Oh, trying to attack down the people who attacked me. Know anything about Not them? much, other than there are a bunch of freeloaders who expected a few rounds on the house. I was able to get them to pay up, though. Of course, one of the great cons did knock my radio to the floor by accident. And it hasn't been working since. They were having some kind of argument about it, but the guy in the checkered coat kept shushing them. Sounded like they came in from the north through Quarry Junction. If that's the case, I can't say I blame them for not wanting to go back. That whole area is overrun with the kind of critters that just get mad if you shoot them. Merchants avoid that whole stretch of I-15 like it's radioactive, which it could be for all I know. I didn't hear exactly, but the leader was talking about the strip. 
Fella wants to get there and avoid the 15, he'd have to go east. Take Highway 93 up. Sure, the outside looks okay, but I think something broke on the inside. There'd be caps in it for you. I do like to hear what's going on. Okay. The radio, radio seems to be working. Repair the radio. Feeling thirsty? Fix the radio. Yeah, I heard it turn right back on after you got done tinkering with it. Here's some caps for the work. Not oh, at all. Damn it. I'm never sure how much is normally charged for this sort of thing. Now. Be careful out there. Okay. I always thought that that option give, gave bad karma. So I never picked it because I, I don't want bad karma. Uh, oh, three guys. Howdy. Hey there. What gun do you have? I know maybe. Where's ZCP? Oh, oh no. Okay. Oh, maybe I should get my hunting rifle. Ah, oh, I won't need firepower that big. Unless. make a move that's close enough who Ooh, are you got and what do you want pistol. with me so you can tell because of the rounded top as opposed to the flatter top of the uh, nine millimeter pistols sorry about the gun we got off to a bad start what say we yeah he doesn't look very tough though i hear he's afraid i'll shoot him down from one of the windows when i see him and he's right I'll have a much bigger problem once his friends show up. I'm gonna lay low for as long as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I've got no chance against the gang on my own. We just end up sharing the same grave if it's just... Start with Sunny Smiles. She's been friendlier than most around here. Sweet. Okay. New gun. Sunset. Sunset. Food. Uh, doctor's bag. That's great. That doctor's bag is going to be great, actually. Uh, golden beans, potato crisps. I think there's, yeah, stem packs are back here. Uh, a Braxo cleaner. Whiskey, vision battery. I'm a hoarder in this game. I just take whatever stuff I can find. Auto caps. Carton of cigs. I don't need the 9mm. Sunset Pastorilla. Safe. Darkwood 9mm pistol. What is this? Is it just a re It's just a retextured 9mm pistol with. I'm gonna assume darker hand grips. Yep, darker hand grips. Also, no, he did not have a 223 pistol. It just looked that way. Um, so I guess I can start putting shit away. Okay. Talk to Sunny. Sleep until morning. Six, seven, 
eight, nine. That's good. Howdy, partner. Oh, that's the Don Quixote guy. Fidgeting with my fingers right now, sorry. Had to get in between those creases. Okay. Hi there. Sticking around Good Springs for a while longer? I'm gonna need to help Ringo take on the Powder Gangers. I might need your help. Say no more. I'm in. Just, just like that? Just like that. I have a feeling that I'm going to end up fighting those guys one way or another, so I might as well get it over with. Joe Cobb talks about leaving us alone if we hand over Ringo, but I know his type. He and his friends will come after the town eventually. However, between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. If you could convince Trudy to join us, some of the folks in town might decide to help out as well. I know Easy Pete's got a stock of dynamite somewhere, and Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Finally, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up some extra stim packs, that'd be great. Oh shit, I forgot I was... <laughs> I started finger spelling in AS... I started doing the alphabet in ASL. Uh. I don't think... Easy. Man, okay. Goodbye. I'll be... Easy Pete. Howdy. What can Easy Pete do for you? Got dynamite. Too dangerous. Gonna kill all yourselves if I let you touch it. Better to leave it buried. Safer that way. I'm familiar with the care and handling of explosives, dynamite included. Uh-huh. Guess you know what you're doing. I'll go dig it up and get it ready. You'll have it by the time the fighting starts. Keep your gun handy if you go poking around some of the abandoned places around here, like the schoolhouse. Critters move in there sometimes. Then I'll talk to Trudy, then I'll talk to Jeff, then I'll talk Hey there. To so you're planning on taking on Joe Cobb's gang? Okay. That does sound like a good plan. Alright, you seem to know what you're doing, so you can count me in. Let me have a word with a few other folks, and I'll see if I can't round up some more members for this militia you're creating. While everyone does own a gun, we could stand to be a little better equipped. The general store probably has what we need in stock. Be careful out there. Howdy. You created new save files, some of that's leveled up. And I don't know if my perk every level mod is gonna work. Check. You looking to buy some supplies? Now just hold on. I never voted to take on the powder gangers. That's a thousand cap investment you're talking about. You made your point. I can provide people with some leather armor and extra ammo. Sure hope it's worth it. And uh, I'll be guarding the store while all this is going on. I have to put my business first. You understand. Chad is such Take a it easy bitch. now. And he's like, oh, he's a store owner. He's gonna really protect the store for some problems. He's still a little bitch. Like, bro, don't be such a little bitch. Think about all these people. How are you holding up? Seems like wherever I go, it's always the same. Folks just never leave each other alone. Oh, I'm not much good in a fight with my bum leg. And my supplies are scarce. But I'll give you what I can spare. I ain't got much, but it'll do you more good out there than it will in here. Take what I got. You take care now. Go straight for 50 barter. Sneak first. Speech is next. Oh, I want to go straight for lockpick so I can get lucky. There. 
there. Okay, that's a pretty balanced spread, I think. Um, okay. Swift learner, retention, intense training. Oh, intense training could be good. I do want to take this perk because it's cool. Although, I'd rather get intense training because it's just kind of better. Okay, six. I go straight for 10 intelligence. No, that's not necessary. Agility, endurance, strength. I'll put a bonus point into strength. Sorry, I had to text my Nana about something. So, I gained a lot of weight, 145 pounds. But I can carry 10 extra pounds, which is based. It's always based to be able to carry more equipment. Okay, barbell like camo, put that away. Uh, dark wood pistol, right? That was the thing that I picked up. I guess not. I guess I put it away already. What did you put away? I'm actually gonna look at whatever mod is adding all those shitty guns because they're just taking up spaces in the like world loot pool and I don't want to you know deal with that I want cool stuff from other mods that are good not like a shitty texture of weapons that I can already use I don't think it's this project's weaponry mod these models actually look pretty good. Like, they're custom. So it's gotta be... I know which mod it is, then. No, it is! Project Weaponry. Weird. Damn, I don't want to install it, though, because it adds some cool-looking stuff. Some, like, not bad looking things. Uh, I'll live. Yeah, I'll live. Um. So then, which mod is it? Is it the. Okay. Project Weaponry. Moving desert. So it's just Project Weaponry. Okay. Well, that's Kring. Also, I didn't close Mozilla, so I gotta open Mozilla and close that again. Okay, cool. Uh, everything is working out. Leather armor. I forgot I got a uh, leather armor, so I will give that to that one guy that that's perfect. Today is a Friday in California. Howdy, partner! I like that video. Um, fast travel is a good spring source. And someone's car alarm is going off, so I gotta deal with that now. This guy's Sticking around, armor. stranger? I have that leather armor you asked for. Well, good to see. You know, I said I didn't have any money, but I might have a way to repay you. It's a little kit I used back when I was dynamite on the chain fuse. gang. Well, it's mostly a bundle of dynamite fuses and some instructions. You can use it to adjust the length of your dynamite's fuse. Oh, cool. As long as you've got the tools on hand. Oh, so I'll be able to well, make, like... 
I suppose I ought to start making my way down to the Long 15, then. Thanks. For everything, stranger. Oh, and one last thing. I saw some guys from the prison snooping around that old skydiving place. Didn't seem like they were looking for a mark, though. I remember them being among the more trustworthy men in the clink, too. Oh, sweet. You can investigate, I suppose. Well, happy trails, and good luck, stranger. Yeah, later, dude. With a deep breath, Whitmire begins his trek down the road. You wonder if the past will ever come. You're done. You are done. Oh, that stuff is floating in the air. What the fuck? Okay. I'm gonna go investigate this before... What the shit? Oh, D.B. Cooper! Oh, that's so cool. D.B. Cooper Jr. the third. Oh, so they will extend all the way this far out. That's cool. Yeah, they still haven't caught him. Damn, I kind of want to leave that there because it's cool. I'll just take the bottle caps and the ammo, but I want to leave this as it is because I think this is cool. Everyone else, I'm cool with taking their shit. But... Fucking hate them. I don't want to get on their bad side yet, though. You eyeballing me? You eyeballing me. John Skydiving King. CP, C4P4 Hyper Beam Blast, or Hyper Blast, I didn't read it on the time. Uh, Energy Cell, what? 10 millimeter. Is it the, I remember looking in there once and there was like a laser RCW, so I guess the loot will change depending on if you're a higher level or not. Which is cool. I like it when things do that. Still not enough. Never gets old when something blows up. Wild. Hello? Hello? Hello, my name is Zach. It's an interesting shotgun. What's it say? Steak maker. It's the steak maker. Steak maker is my shotty. It allows me to pop cash in the ass of the many buttons who try to square up with me. I've only shot one problem with it, but still. Shot, pop a cap in the ass of anything trying to mess with him. He's only shot one thing. I, I heard to put down busy. Put down busy. There's a close thing to the chicken, love. I don't know, in a long while. But she got the hepatitis C, so I had to put her down. Put her down? And the craziest thing happened. A damn school bus comes by. Oh! And I spray prominent brain all over the first year old kid. I call my shoddy mistake maker. It's not the kid. They're just in therapy. Pussies. <laughs> uh, that's, uh, that's a Napoleon Dynamite reference. He said that his uh, cow got, his Brahmin got hepatitis B, though I think in Napoleon Dynamite it's like a llama. It got hepatitis B, so he had to shoot it. But when he shot it, a bus full of school children came by and they got traumatized, so he went to prison for them. Uh, that's what happens in Napoleon Dynamite. He, uh, Napoleon puts down a, a llama as a school bus of uh, children pass by, and it's a funny scene. Napoleon Dynamite's a very funny movie, but it's also kind of weird. But I guess that's the nature of it. So what'd you do before you ended up here anyway? I used to raise chicken, but they were all There's killed chickens. by chicken nugget gang. Something killed his chicken nugget. Chicken. So I'm out of your farming stupid plan. I don't bro. love you like a chicken does. Oh, farming bronze. <laughs> like, good talk, man. Huh. You eyeballing me? So they're only, are there only two? No, there's a Never gets old. Hold it right there. Keep it calm and civil, and so will we. What's your business here? We sold some convicts for poking. Who the hell told you about? <sighs> Never mind. If you didn't open fire on us immediately, then you're not with Eddie. Since you're not with Eddie's crew, then I got a job offer for you. 
Some risk, but should be manageable as long as the boys at the correctional facility don't want to gut you on sight. I need you to investigate the nearby prison. You hear of anything that threatens their position there? Report back to me. You might have to do some busy work for them before they'll trust you with anything that could threaten their position. But once you hear of anything potentially useful, report back to me for your payment and the second part of the job. Oh, cool. All right. We'll be here waiting. What's up the blows up? I wonder... Oh, you wonder... I wonder if that means that I won't be able to do the, uh, the NCR quest then. I wonder if those two will cancel out. God, I want to kill these guys so bad. What the fuck? Is... Is that a Gewehr or a Carcano? Either way, he shouldn't have that. Fucking 308. That's a very small baseball bat. That's like a cricket bat. Okay. That's a sweet bat. Never gets old when something blows up. A Soviet pistol. That's from a mod. And this guy has just a 9mm Some Jimmy. Oh no! If I do Ghost Town Gunfight, I'll probably get uh Villa Fly. Oh, who are you? You again. Oh, this guy. Watch your backup. F5. Oh, man. Okay, so I should probably go do the quest for Eddie at the prison first. Who are you? Barton's Hello? Oh, Can you help me? I was My girl is trapped by geckos on the ridge, and I can't get to her. I he Please, where she's going to die. Sunny smiles goes for the, uh, the campfire and all the trails. Go up the path, past the broken radio tower, and go to the right. They're at the top of the trail. You will? Thank you for helping me. Please hurry. Cool. Uh, can I make anything? Also, oh, I saw that mountain glitch out. Ain't no thing, though. I forgot about my low action points. I should put a point into agility next. Oh, this thing sucks. It's got a very high mag size, but like... Why is this thing so bad? I feel like I should be, and I have that one thing, I feel like I should be performing a lot more critical hits.
cool. Still in danger. Jack and Joe went up the hill because some guy told them to. Jack fell down and broke his crown. Luckily, Jill had a stim pack. Okay. Um. Jill. Lever action shotgun. Oh, it's a like a circumcised lever action shotgun. It's cut down like a son of a bitch. Also, it takes 12 gauge, which I'm not sure is unique to the. I Sorry I tricked you, but thanks for clearing out the geckos. Now I can get oh, to that no, stash up there, betrayer. after I he deal with you. What Whatever shall I do? I'd shoot him in the head again, but I don't want to waste the ammo. Okay, so I shouldn't do Ghost Town Gunfight... ...yet. Because I think with the amount of powder gangers I'm gonna kill from that, it'll leave me vilified with the powder gangers. Actually, I can just loop that up. Will Ghost Town Gunfight leave me vilified with. Ghost Town Gunfights. Do the booted quest to get from boxcars at the Nipton General Store. 100 rep of the Powder Gangers. Outfits or death picks. Okay, yeah, I just won't do Ghost Town Gunfight yet. MCRC app is over there, but I do, no, I should do this first, that way I could tell, um, my use at the MCRC app. If any of you have never played New Vegas, you're about to understand. I shouldn't talk ahead about stuff I'm going to do, because I'm sure that makes for a bad watching experience. Who are you? Hey there. Prospector. What do you have? Oh, that's like a, that's a deagle? Stop turning around, I wanna look at your butt. That's either the 357 or 44 on the looter. I don't know which one it is by color. If it's the 44, I, sh I don't think they'd give 
an NPC of 44 this early, though, because, you know, that'd be kind of valuable. Am I going to get some escape? Uh-oh. Is he catching up? Not really. Still the... No, this is gonna leave me a bad rep. God dang it. Are these guys powder gangers though, or are they just regular bandits? Oh, what? Oh, he just crit me. Okay, I'm gonna have to kill you. Um. Where is my. Oh, I did have one. Who the hell? That didn't go down. Oh, that put me down. Thanks for your shit, bro. Gonna fuck with me, I guess. Okay, now I'm gonna put that away because I'm running out of 12 gauge. I'll start using. Uh, this, I guess, because I like 22. Although it's not very strong. Deputy Beagle, he's still alive, so technically this would be stealing. But he's a coward, so... Oh no. Ooh, fuck. Yeah, you got a lot of stuff in here, buddy. I'm taking it. 410, 22. I guess I can sell that. Oh, okay. Uh, I guess I could use this one. Aoka pistol. Or like a dueling pistol, maybe? Maybe it has a special effect. Uh, yeah, they are dead. They are very dead. Uh, sheriff's outfit is that unique box of detergent. 10 millimeter round. Ramen skin outfits. I've never seen this before. So I think I dropped something. Oh, son of a bitch. What did I drop? I don't think it was anything too special. Um, Miss McBain was very white. Like, they are very, very white. Okay, they're not tied to 
the powder gangers in any way. Oh, maybe its special effect is one-shotting, uh, like, convict-type enemies? I don't think so. I think it's just strong. Oh, maybe I can sell these to uh, Johnston now. Oh, that's where the other convict was. I knew they could. Right there. I don't know what it was brought you to Prim, youngster, but you might want. Uh, who are you? Johnson Nash is Johnson. my name. Husband to Ruby Nash. Lived in Prim going on eight years now, thick and thin. I'm a trader primarily, for what it's worth with things like they are. I also run the local Mojave Express outpost. Well, I don't got any work right now, sorry to say. I'll tell you whatever I can. You have a delivery order you can show me? Oh, so you're talking about one of them packages. That job had strange written all over it, but we couldn't turn down the caps. That cowboy robot had us hire six couriers. Oh, Victor! Each was carrying something a little different. A pair of dice, chess piece, that kind of stuff. Last word I have in the office, it looked like payment had been received for the other five jobs. Guess it was just your chip that didn't make it. First deadbeat we hired to do the job canceled. Hope a storm from the divide skins later. him alive. Well, that's where you came in. Yeah, I got this look when he saw you next down on the courier list. His expression turned right around. Asked me if your name was for real. I said, sure as lack of rain, you were still kicking. Then he turned down the job, just like that. I asked if he was sure it was good money. No, let Courier 6 carry the package. That's that what he said. Like the Mojave sort you out or something. Then he just up and walked out. No idea. Sounds like you two had a history for him to act like that and turn down the money too. Hope he didn't see any trouble in that package of yours. Maybe he thought your name was bad luck. Enough for me to say. Well, now that you mentioned it, a few nights back, one of the town... He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come... Well, for that, your best... Since they came... He may have... Heard. Okay, what is he selling? Here we go. Well, you... Problem is, I ain't going into my shop until I know it's good and safe. Oh. Oh, is that inside the bison steed? What can I do to help you? Right now, Beagle is the closest. First thing I... Oh. Hey there. What do you have? Single shotgun. Uh... Oh, so this is all stuff I'd have to steal. Damn it. Oh, Silent 22 pistol. Okay, I don't mind getting a little bit of a bit of wonder if there's a unique weapon here. Because the mod that I installed at clearly added plenty of unique weapons, so... Hey. Hey there. Maybe it's on the they're on the slot table somewhere. Is this stealing? Yes it is. I don't want to steal anymore. 
I'll steal plenty later, but for the moment, I don't want to do another stealing. Ouch. Which is like a first for me, not stealing. Hello. Hello. Ugh. Why can't they just have this stuff free? Why? I don't want to steal you, I just want to keep you. How okay. Oh, just a thing. Just a thing. God dang. Okay. So there's no. Oh, right, I forgot. There's already a Unite. Wow. Oh, what? I didn't think there were people in there. J3R1. Alien Power Cell. Alien Power Cell? Many. Holy shit, a hundred times. Um, what's this reference to? Maybe Ghost in the Shell? In Vicky and Fancy's A Prim You discovered what appeared to be the corpse of a beautiful lady wearing a one piece and definitely Ghost in the Shell. On closer inspection, you realized her body was covered with small cybernetic attachments which probably previously kept her alive, and that suit was probably quite shiny in the past. Metallic people. Yep, definitely goes from the show. As you stared further at her, you also noticed tiny movements under skin and very quiet whirring and clicking motions that is equal to you both tiny seven. Nope, I don't know what that is. Seven of nine. Seven of nine. I'm gonna look that up. Star Trek. Is that a vault suit? What 101? What 101? Wait, no, that's not in this game. That's vault. That's Fallout 3, right? Vault 101? I know Vault 111 is New Vegas. Or no, Vault 111 is Fallout 4. Uh, also. Oh, hey, buddy. There is, yeah, Dropbox in there. That's a good spring. Uh, okay. 10mm pistol, body bug revolver, that thing, that thing, that thing. I 
should have kept the silent 22 pistol with me. I'm a silly goose. 